Hey guys, hey YouTube, um, this is a, another video from Tulsa Bedbug Specialist. So, um, today we're doing a treatment at a home and uh, the customer gave me their permission to uh, show a quick video. So all I'm gonna do is show you kind of one of the tools we use for dust. And so these are two different dusters I use, the bulb and the old school kind of duster. Um, and the best places to use these guys are going to be in electrical outlets. Take the plates off, push the dust in there. And there's another good place is sometimes these beds and furniture doesn't break down. So in the little grooves, like you see this little, little groove in there, throw some dust in there, squeeze some in there. And at some of the joints like that, you want to squeeze. Another good place is... For instance, this is not a recliner, but if you had one, you would just hit the recline button and in, in the cracks and crevices of the chair, you want to squeeze some dust in there as well. Um, so this is definitely a kind of do-it-yourself um, uh, treatment. Um, any voids that could be in your uh, furniture or around your furniture, you want to use some dust. And when I say voids, I mean areas where there's a hole or a crack inside, but you know there's more space in there. So for instance, there's a little crack in the outlet, but when you put dust in it, um, it fills that void. So if there's any bed bugs in there, they'll get that product on them and then they will die. And so sometimes if you can't disassemble furniture, this is kind of the best. I have a special little tip on mine that will get in these little holes like this and it will kind of coat that area inside with dust, thus killing the bed bugs. Because if you could spray something and it's only going to coat it on the outside, it's not going to get inside. So that's why you want to use dust. And that's a good reason to use dust. And the dust I recommend is Semexa. I'll put a link in the description. Um, so thanks for watching. Follow, like, and share this video.